we just delivered a package guys there you go all right pretty easy right now you just we just got to do that a hundred more times <laughs> something like that all right okay we're gonna get in the vehicle i put it back in the mount I'll put my seat belt back on okay the next one is on a different street so we're gonna we're gonna leave here i'm gonna click the next delivery it's on a street called lemonwood okay guys and that's the next one so so my route the route that I've been assigned to has this, a bunch of courts. Every route has its own little quirk. Some of them will have apartments. Some of them, you know, some of them will be up in the hills and stuff. And you'll be going weird places. And yeah, so. Fortunately, I have a route that's pretty much all houses, guys. So, so I've, I've been very lucky. Um, this is a, These are very nice neighborhoods, you know. Um, these people order a lot of stuff, man. It's crazy sometimes. So you'll notice that certain houses get more deliveries than other. Okay, so Lemonwood is the next one. So as you can see, um, yeah, if you have a package for the next block, you're not going to drive very far for the next deliveries, right? So we're looking for 755. And if you don't even if you don't even know, like at night, I like to use the GPS a lot because you can't see the house numbers. The GPS will tell you which house it is. All right. Okay. Stop here. Melt off. I grab the phone. Hit start. This one says oh, it's only one package. Some some have more than one package, guys. I'm looking for a lemon wood package. I see lemon wood here, but um, that's not the one we're looking for. So I want to remember that that's there. So here we go. Now now becomes the I'm looking for shit. <laughs> So depending on how well you uh, organized everything, guys, is uh, how it's going to be thing, man. And unfortunately, this until you, you don't know what kind of size the package is. So it could be a box, but I always go for these small ones first. And then I look around here. So all of these are my lower numbers here. So I'm just rifling around, cast wood, and wood. I'm looking for any package that says lemon wood, all right? So I did have one that said lemon wood. So we'll take that one out and I'll put that one down here so I know we're gonna go there later. Um, okay, if I can't find it here, it might be in the back. So if there's, I'll put like a bigger packages in the back um, that you can't take out the front. And it might be this one right here. Yep, and sure enough it is. All right, so this is one of the big packages that are in the back. See, it's very similar to uh, how a package car is organized, guys. Um, generally, if they can't fit it on a shelf, they just put it in the back and they put rear doors where it is. So, so you'll know where to look. All right, oh, this one's a big one. It's heavy too. Okay, this one I can't hide it, so I just put it on the front door. I just I do my best to try to hide it. If there's no place to hide it, then what can I do? All right, I also have a pouch. Oh, this phone, man. Okay, I'm taking the picture. Stop complete. Package delivered. Okay, I also have a pouch on my hip here. All right, and that's where I put my info notices. All right, that's the door tags. There's info notices in there. And I also put the phone in there if i have to carry the package with two hands i have to, i put it in there it's like a holster for the for the phone okay guys um you could use uh well my suggestion is uh if you don't have anything like that uh buy pants that have cargo pockets guys okay so next one is 760 oh it's, it's right across never mind i got inside for no reason all right so yeah so the next delivery is right across the street so i'm going to just grab that package that we found earlier it's per it's perishable guys so gotta get it delivered before it spoils all right so this one was right across okay i scanned the package you can there's all there's two ways that you can do it too if you, uh, if the numbers are messed up oh i guess this is their mailbox or something i'm gonna hide it back here though <laughs> A lot of the times there'll be dogs barking at you like that. Some of them are fairly vicious, so <laughs> stay away from them. Some of them are nice, some of them aren't. Um, yeah, and then uh, I don't, 
I used to ring the doorbell when I leave, but a lot of people have these security doorbells and stuff now, and they got cameras and everything. They'll know if you're there. <laughs> Everyone's got them now, man. All right, so we're going to someplace called Castwood. That's the next block over. All right, I'm going to get, like, the first couple deliveries, guys. All right, I see a car that's going to pull out of the driveway there, so I'm going to turn right here. Oh, also, I'm going to put my vehicle in eco mode, all right? So I have an eco mode. Um, when you're driving really slow, I feel like the eco mode on the RAV4 Prime is the best. Um, that's the only thing I use it for. <laughs> Other than that, I use sport mode all the time, but the, the throttle is less touchy in the eco mode. Okay, so let me make it right here. Oh, there's got some freaking construction here again, man. All right, we're going to make another ride onto Casswood here, and then we're looking for 738. It's just right across the street. I right, see it. I'm looking at it right now, okay? Um, it's actually more beneficial to park across the street from where you're delivering because you don't have to well, you don't have to walk around your vehicle, okay? That's just the way it is. You know, on a package car, you can go in and out whatever way, but not this one. <laughs> like the, the driver's side is the way. Best way. Oops. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, sometimes if you close it manually, you get... There's a special code to, to open the phone. All right, so 738 is this one right here, all right? So lucky you, Hayes Mega, you found it right away. I think there's another Castwood in here, so I'm pretty sure there's another delivery. So this one is across the street here from where we parked. See, it's a lot easier. I don't have to walk around the vehicle. And I always go to that door to look for packages first, okay? If I can't find it, I go to the back, and then I go to the other side. So, so that's the way I have it sorted. Um, I will just hide it behind the pot here. Okay, take a picture. Okay, see, see that has a Nest camera. So they, um, they're, they're videotaping you while you're delivering it, so. <laughs> okay, so there's another one on this street. It's 737, and it's the one that we parked at, okay? <laughs> so we'll go grab, we'll see if I can find it. <laughs> so we don't have to move, we stay, stay here. Typically, if I have to walk more than like 10 to 20 feet, then I will move. Okay. Oh, I got another one. There's another one on Castlewood, but okay, here's here it is. 737 Castlewood. You know, I'm lucky. All these first deliveries are small. Okay, scan the package. Okay, this is uh, so if you guys don't know how the way streets work, there's like odd side, there's an like even side, all right? So all the odds will be on one side and all the evens will be on one side. I'm gonna hide it behind the jack-o'-lantern here. Okay, I try my best to hide it as good as I can, guys, but if you don't leave anything in front of your house for me to hide it in front of, then that's 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 on you guys. <laughs> I got no place to hide it, you know? Some, some people will request you to put it in funky places. All right, so we're going to 745. Okay, that's so that's like two houses over. Uh, I think I'm gonna drive there, so okay, I don't really want to walk that. All right, you want to try to minimize, uh, you know, getting tired. <laughs> that's all I want to say. All right, you don't want to go too fast, you don't want to go too slow. Okay, and shh, don't say anything. I didn't put my seatbelt on. All right, <laughs> don't, don't say anything. I'm not supposed to do that, but. But they don't have a, they don't have sensors telling them that I didn't do that. All right, so they can't they can't look on they can't like say anything. <laughs> now the drivers they do that. All right, the drivers they can tell if you didn't put your seatbelt on and you move the vehicle, and then they'll say, "Oh, you've been naughty." So, yeah. Okay, I scan the package. Walk up the driveway here. Some of these houses got really long driveways, guys. It sucks, dude, and they got lots of steps. I'm gonna hide it behind this umbrella thing here. Okay, sometimes you'll go up to a house and you'll see a ton of packages and I just kind of throw it to the side of them, you know? This looks like a Porsche 911, by the way, guys. <laughs> I can tell by the shape. Okay, so there, I got another one in Castlewood. It's 750. It's this house right here. Okay, so that's close enough where I don't want to move the car, so. Damn, we got a lot on this block. See, you can see we already banged out like four stops right just now. <laughs> okay, so I'm looking for any packages that say Castwood. I'm going to look through the small stuff first. 
luckily we've been really lucky I, i've had a i sorted it really well <laughs> i sorted it well and i got lucky you know so <laughs> i normally it's not like this guys usually i'm lo digging around looking for freaking packages it could be that one that's on in the front there I... nope says there's another one but i can't find it i know i saw another one hiding around here let me see that's a grim oh right here okay so i've got this big one here like i said if i can't find it on the side it might be in the back so i'm gonna hit start and that's the one i'm looking for hey these are all these are low 7000 this is a 7044 package guys so so we're we're doing the we're delivering the low 7000s all right guys so it was up to me whether I wanted to move the vehicle or not. I typically, I don't want to move the vehicle as much as possible, but I don't want to walk a whole lot either. So, so like I said, I had 20 feet, like this is just about 20 feet. So well, I'm getting, I'm getting sweaty. I'm wearing my hat, my, my beanie right now. Okay. I'm just going to put it right here. There's no place to really hide this one. And then this one has like a skylight that's open. Okay. So if it rains, it's going to get wet. So. That's another thing when you when you're delivering packages. All right, take a picture, stop complete. All right, go on to the next one. All right. Oh, there's another one on this street. Freaking a, dude. All right. There's another delivery, and it's at the end of the block there. Okay, guys. Ah, oh, crack. Dude, there's a lot of one, two, three, four, five. There's five deliveries on this one street. So you, as you can see, it's not hard to bang out a lot of deliveries in a short amount of time, guys. It's sometimes it's like delivering mail, okay? All right, we're just going to move up there really slowly. I'm going to creep up there, 759. Okay, I, don't, I, I should have all of these packages, so I didn't see any more Castlewood packages in here. I looked and I looked. I was like, what the heck? There's no more. They keep on saying that we got packages for here. Keep looking. All right, so since we're kind of like in the middle of the court, I'm gonna put my hazards on here. Okay, and then we're gonna look for this package. Uh, since I did, I since I looked through everything on the side already and I didn't see any more Castlewood packages, I'm gonna hopefully find it back here. Oh, I don't see it. Okay, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna start organizing. Oh, it could be this one right here. So I'm gonna put take this out. You don't as much as possible. You don't want packages in the front of your vehicle. So, as you're delivering, you want to organize your vehicle, guys. Uh, this is a 71. I want to put this on top of everything. So I'm gonna put this right here, so I can see it from the front. I can grab it, but dude, I don't see it. It could be that one that's over there. A Dale Wood. You know, this one is going to be a while too. I don't want this up here. Take this out. Organize, organize. Okay. Okay, now I got more room to look for stuff. So I'm going to look through the small packages again. Sometimes I overlook stuff. Sea wood. Sea wood. There's a lot of seawood packages there. Clay wood. Clay wood. I don't see it anywhere, man. Swan. Almond. Almond. So that's the way they have these streets named, guys. They just name... They just put wood at the end of something, you know? Clay. Clay wood. Grim's wood. Oh, there it is. Okay, so sometimes, yeah, you got to dig around in there a little bit, all right? But for the most part, everything I'm looking for should be on this left side. All right, so I'm going to close this, and I'm going to go deliver this. Okay, see, with the super grip gloves, I have awesome strength, guys. I can palm, pack, palm pretty light packages with one hand. <laughs> all right, but, yeah, I'm just going to put this back here. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so uh, the next part on the route is it's Almond Wood, and Almond Wood is like a long street. It's a pass through street, all right? That's the way these guys were. Okay, turn the hazard off. I will try to narrate as best as I can, guys. Okay, I, I can look at the map and I can see where we're going. It, the, the phone likes to go to sleep every once in a while, so I have to keep on tapping it, all right? And yes, I know I shouldn't be looking at it while I'm driving, but you know, what can you do? <laughs> Some drivers, they, I'll, I'll, I already know where to go, guys. So we're going to the end of Almond Wood, all right? That's the way this route works. It, we, um, on this street, they have you go all the way to the end and then they make you do a U-turn and then you deliver everything, all right? So we're going all the way to the end of this block. It's, and you, it's not usually the end of the block. It's just the last delivery on the, the first delivery in the block is at the end of the block, all right? So we're going to drive all the way to the end of the block for this one. We're going to deliver it and I guarantee you there's going to be more deliveries we're going to do on the way back. All right, so it, every route has like a certain way that you're supposed to do it, all right? That's the way they want you to do it. Do you have to do it that way? You don't necessarily don't have to. Sometimes there are some exceptions where if you do it a different way, it's actually, you know, more beneficial or you can get some stuff out of your vehicle that you don't want in there, you know, like it takes up a lot of space or something. So this is the very last house, guys. All right, so since there's a van up there, I'm just gonna park right here in front of the mailboxes. This is not the ideal spot. What we could do is we could turn around too. It doesn't matter, guys. <laughs> we're, we're gonna turn around anyways. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna hit start. I'm gonna go look for this package. All right, it's an uh, almond wood. Oh, here's one. There's it. So this one has two packages, guys. So there's two tracking numbers on the MDA. So I'm gonna scan it. Yeah, usually when I scan, when I have multiple packages, I put them on top. All right, if it's light, I'll put it on top. And then that way I know I scanned it already. And there, and there it is. There's another one. So the packages look similar. So I put them to, close to each other. Okay. See, I make this look easy, right, guys? It's not. It's not always this easy, guys. <laughs> Remember how I was digging around for that last one? Yeah. That's not a good idea to leave your charge cable on the ground like that. The J, J plug could rain or you could run it over. <laughs> it would be all bad, dude. Okay, I'm going to go hide it behind here. Looks like somebody's doing that. Vacuuming. Okay, I, it asks me if it's a residential or commercial. It's a residential, and it automatically asks to take a picture, and I hit stop complete. All right. If you go out, you can put what where you delivered it, like front door, back door, porch, whatever. All right. That's the old school way they used to do it. All right. They don't do that anymore. They just have you take a picture of it, and that's it. I said, all oh, a picture's good enough. I can only imagine how much data UPS uses for these pictures, man. <laughs> there must be thousands and thousands. Okay, so we're at 793, and now we got to go to 757. Like I mentioned, we got to turn around now, all right, because we passed it already. So if you were high speed, you could do it. We could already deliver the ones that we passed by already, but we already we passed them. That's the way the route works, guys. Okay, so I'm driving to 757. It's gonna be on our left according to GPS. And it's gonna be right here where this street thing or the this intersection is daggum. All right, I don't I don't normally do it, but they don't want you to do it. I'm gonna park on the wrong side. <laughs> Just because there's no way to park on the other side. Okay, I'm gonna hit start. Get out. Oh, there's FedEx right there. There's a competition. You, you'll see lots of other people delivering stuff throughout the day. All right, so we're looking for almond. There, 757 almond. There you go. Shutterfly package. Yeah, also, I'll kind of go over some of the stuff that we're delivering, guys. So this is Shutterfly. I think they, they do, like, camera photo stuff, all right? Like, if you want to get some photos printed or something the people that you would do, go to all right so okay stop complete okay so that was the last delivery for this block so we're gonna we're gonna vacate this block 
<laughs> we're gonna go to the next one which is on Swan's Road. okay so sometimes sometimes you might not even have a delivery for a certain street and you'll skip it all right but today it looks like we're gonna do all of them <laughs> so far we've done them all all right so look carefully take off Okay, shh, they don't want you to do that, guys. They, they don't want you to uh, park on the wrong side. But for that for that case, I felt that was safer because I didn't have to cross the street. There is nowhere to park. I would have to walk a longer distance. I felt it was safer to go on the left side. I, I guarantee you there are some other drivers that do it, man. <laughs> if, it, if it's safer to, to go on the wrong side, then I would do it, all right? You know? Is it legal? I don't know. Is it illegal to park your vehicle facing the wrong way? I don't know. All right, so they got some construction stuff going on here, but we're gonna we're gonna go to the street first before we get to the construction. And these guys have been doing this construction. There, I think they're doing something with the sewer system. All right, so 720 is right here. We just passed it. I'm gonna stop right here, and then we're on a block called Swanswood. Ooh, I kind of took my hat off, man. I'm getting getting hot. So. During the day, it's going to get warm, and then it's going to get cooler. <laughs> oh, hi, dude. Today, it's been pretty cool, though, so... So, I have a 733 Swanswood. We'll deliver that one later. I don't see any other Swanswood packages. Maybe it's this one here. All right, that's a 733 Swanswood. So, these two are together. I'm going to put them together right here. We're still looking for this other, the one that we just. So I'm gonna start organizing. Oh, here it is, 715. Oh, this is not it either, man. <laughs> this is the next one. Yeah, I'll put that right there too. Okay. Um, there's another Swanswood package in here, and it's right here. Yeah, this is it. Okay. This is that pack. This is that package that I had. Uh, where did I have this? Well, this is the package I had in the front of the car. Remember, I moved it back here. Scan it. Yes, I can scan packages without looking at it, guys. <laughs> as long as you get the camera, so the, the way the scanner works on this thing is it uses a camera to take a picture of the barcode. All right, as long as you kind of get the camera in that area, there's nowhere to hide this one, guys. So we're just gonna put it on a chair here. Okay, also one thing I like to do uh, is double check the address when I deliver it. So it says 720 Swanswood, and I make sure I look at the house number and it says 720, okay? And then there's a street sign that says Swanswood right there. There's no way I delivered it to the wrong place, guys. <laughs> so I hit stop complete. Yeah, I always double check if I'm delivering in the right place. Like I said, it has a GPS too. 733 is the next one. I don't think it's two houses over. We're going to get in the car and move. Okay. Uh, yeah, sometimes... Uh, uh, what is it? I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It has a GPS. So if, you do, if you're in the wrong spot and you try to deliver it, it will tell you, hey, are you sure you're in the right spot? All right, it will, it will tell you, all right, it'll complain. All right, so the house is right here, but I wanna park in front of the house. So when I get out of the vehicle, we'll be closer to it. All right, I always, uh, for me, I don't know, for, for this vehicle, since the front is so long, I like to go out the back, all right? Because we're already at the back when we open this, so. All right, 733. Remember those packages I looked at earlier? This one has two, right? The two, the two that I set aside earlier are right here. Okay, so now, boom, and boom. Okay, two packages scanned. We're gonna go deliver it. Some flat thing, uh, an Amazon Prime package, okay? Um, typically, UPS delivers UPS Prime, <laughs> UPS, uh, Amazon Prime, guys. <laughs> they deliver Amazon Prime. Uh, that's what I've noticed. Uh, Amazon delivers Amazon stuff, all right? But if you're like a Prime member, you chances are you're gonna get a UPS. So I'm gonna hit residential here. Sometimes it asks that. We're gonna hide it right there. Okay. Um, generally, this neighborhood doesn't have a problem with theft, all right? Porch pirates, pi porch piracy, <laughs> say. All right, the next one is 715. Did we pass it already? Yeah, we did pass it already. Hey, freaking A, man. We could've just... Yeah, it's that one over there. That's fine. Well, uh, I'll just walk over there. We could have delivered that one. It's kind of like in the middle, though. Okay, we'll just take this. All right, I'm gonna walk it. 
All right, it's a little far, but it's okay. There's not a lot of uh, parking here. So the nice thing about this route is there's generally a lot of parking. Oh. Oh, this is, hold on. Never mind. Never mind, guys. I was mistaken. Okay. Uh, this is the wrong. <laughs> We're on the wrong street. The next delivery is on a different street. For some reason, I thought this was the next one. I thought. I think this is the next one, though. Let me see. Yeah, this is the next one. Okay, so. The next delivery is three streets over, all right, guys? So, so I remember I said I, we skipped sometimes, so there's a, there's a street called Huntswood Court on the next one. These are all courts, guys. There's a street called Huntswood, and uh, it's, um, and we're just gonna, we're gonna skip it because we don't have any packages for it, so. So depending on how heavy or how light your load is, you know, you may, you may be skipping streets, you know? And it saves a lot of time. Today is not that heavy. So I'm assuming we're going to have enough time to go do more work today. So I'm kind of hungry already. I kind of want to take a break. Let's, uh, after the next street, I'm going to take a break, man. So you can take breaks whenever, I mean, pretty much whenever you want, man. But yeah, don't, you know, we've been moving pretty fast. I'm not going to lie because I'm trying to make this video. This guy wants to stop me. We're going to skip this Huntswood here. Oh boy, I hope we don't go to down Seawood. Oh my god, we can't even go down Seawood. <laughs> okay, we're right, going down this. We're gonna go make a right here on what's called Grimswood and 715. That's probably the first house. Yes, it is. All right, um, I can park here or park at the mailbox. I try not to park at the mailbox when the mailman comes around because obviously, they don't wanna, but sometimes you gotta. Okay. Uh, like I mentioned. Typically, this, um, typically this, uh, um, street, um, oh no, typically this route, the, wow, I can't believe it scanned that, the, the, the barcode was like curving and stuff. <laughs> You'd be surprised the stuff that this, this phone can scan, man. <laughs> um, honestly, I like the laser better. And one thing I don't like about the phone is you, you, you have to, you, you can't, you have to use uh, gloves that will work with the phone. Um, it's hard to use gloves with this phone. So I'm going to hide this one back here. But people can probably see it from over there. Oh, spider web. Man. Okay. Okay. Picture. Stop complete. All right. There's another one on this block, 726. It's, um, it's, it's up there a little bit. We're going to get, we're going to move the vehicle. Okay. Oh yeah. Also, what I like to do is leave. I like to put my steer, uh, my my seat at the lowest. I forgot to do it, but I like to lower my seat all the way and move my steering wheel all the way up so I can get in and out of the vehicle without bumping into the steering wheel. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna put my seatbelt on. Shh. Don't say anything. We're just moving up two houses, so it's okay. <laughs> Very slowly too. All right. There we go. All right. Right here is good. Um, try not to block people's driveways. I try not to. If I have to, I, I will, you know. So sometimes you got, you don't have a choice, guys. Sometimes you got to park in the street, too. Just think of how the delivery drivers feel, man. Uh, so we're looking for a, another Grimswood package. It should be, it may be one of the packages that we don't have. Let me see. Oh, well, let's look around first. That's wood. Okay, so, man, I don't have a lot of packages anymore, man. This is a easy. This is an easy route today, guys. Um, I'm, I'm not lying. It's it's harder than this normally. Seawood. Clay was it? No, it was Grim. Grim's wood. I don't see it, man. Oh, here it's right here. Some, okay, I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes I'm uh, I'm just looking at packages, looking for packages, and like uh, um, it's it's sitting there right in front of me, and I I don't even see it. I overlook it, so. Okay, man, this house has like a weird gate. This one's already open, so. 
Let's go this way. You're definitely going to get your steps work out as a UPS driver, guys. Like, oh, there's no way around it, man. Some of these, and you're going to do, and you're going to do steps like this. So these steps are like a weird uh, shape, man. I have to like go up in a weird way. Okay, I'm going to hide behind a dog here. It's an Amazon package. Okay, stop complete. Boom. Easy, right? Easy money. Okay, we're done with this block. I'm gonna take a quick break. Try to leave the stuff to how you found it, all right? That wasn't closed all the way, so I just kind of left it closed. And there's a dog barking at us. I'm pretty sure the person went and picked up their package already. <laughs> Sometimes it's like that, like you just leave and then, then you know, somebody opens the door, grabs the package real quick. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna take a quick break. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have a, some of this uh, Ghirardelli peppermint bark. Man, I'm hungry. I kind of want to eat already, dude. Um, I'm gonna have a beef jerky as well. I'm have. I need something with some. Oh, you know what? I know what I. Mm, delicious. Because I'm so hungry, I want to take. I want to drink a protein drink right now. Okay. So, snack throughout the day, guys. If you get hungry, I didn't. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't eat a lot last night, so that's why I'm hungry right now. Okay, well, water, guys. I'm gonna talk about water. You should bring water. You should drink water because you're gonna die if you don't. <laughs> I try not to drink as much as possible, all right? If I'm thirsty, I take a little sippy sip. The more water I drink, the more I gotta pee, okay? For six, I'm hungry. I'm gonna down this muscle milk. It's got protein, it's got calories. It's got a lot of cholesterol. It's milk, guys, but it's got 50% protein. This is a very physical activity, guys, so you need you need energy to do it, right? Okay, I'll see you guys when I'm done. Our next stop is Dale Wood. All right, I think that's the next street over. Yep. So I can look here on this map. I like to view. If I zoom in on, oh, oh damn it. If I zoom in on the map enough, I can see the, the street names on the map and I can use that, all right, to figure out where we're going. But typically, as you've seen, a lot of deliveries are the next street over. So you really, it's really hard to get lost, guys. So there's this lady that's always, uh, like you probably can't see it, but there's this older lady that's walking around with her walker every day, I see. Good job, lady. I get plenty of exercise throughout the day, so <laughs> doing this job, man. Yeah, this job is very physically demanding, guys. I mean, I'm 40-something, guys. I'm old, so... Um, well, I'm not gonna lie when I was younger I could probably deliver all day long and it wouldn't you know phase me But uh, you know what I've been doing this enough where like I'm getting used to it um, Your body gets used to doing this kind of work. All right guys. Um, it's always rough in the beginning That's that's every delivery job. I've delivered for the post office. I've delivered. I'm just gonna park right here This is the house right here um, Yeah, see that one I didn't even use the map. I just looked at the numbers so um Fortunately, a lot of these houses got nice numbers on it. See, so that one's 743, that's 736, that's 730. I can tell this is 731. See, if you guys don't have nice numbers on your house, it makes it difficult for delivery drivers to find your stuff, man. All right, so Dalewood, I think it was this one right here. All right, over yonder. Okay, so this label, oh, the label's messed up. Okay, if the label's messed up, you can double tap on the tracking number and it it will it will say you have it all right but make sure you have it all right because if you say if you don't have the package and you deliver it then you're gonna get in trouble right <laughs> I'll take this it's kind of big I'm gonna put it on the ground I'll leave it against the wheel so it won't fall over just something soft inside of there so and then there's another Dale wood package in here I think it's this one at the back hope oh, that's clay wood Yeah, this is a really easy route today. Oh, there it is. So see, I'm grabbing everything from the same spot. Um, 
later when we start to get to those packages we're going to grab them and move them this way all right so so like i said everything is going to come out of this side as much as possible this is a disney package <laughs> i don't know what it is all right so i can't uh it says so it says preferred location front door and i put yes all right that's where they want you to deliver it the front door okay i'm gonna put my my mda in my in my pouch here okay Box up, close the door. Sometimes I'll leave the door open. If I know I'm gonna come back. <laughs> you wanna keep the package close to your body as much as possible. That's what they call the power zone, guys. The power zone. This is front door. There's no really, there's not really a place I can hide this, so I mean I guess we could hide it over there, but that's okay. There's already a package here anyway, so that's a FedEx package. Yeah, so I know that's something from Dis the Disney store or something. Okay, we're going to go to some place called Seawood. It's, um... So, Seawood is a, a street that we passed earlier, but it's Seawood Way, alright? So, and it, it goes to... It goes through the whole neighborhood. It's not a court, so... There's two ways we can go this way. Um, according to the map, we can go back the way we came and go through that traffic control point or we can go around this way because this is the end of the, the the street basically this is the end of Camden Avenue um, we can go down Seawood way all right from that way so we're gonna make a right we're not gonna make a left it's your choice <laughs> I choose to go this way all right and the last street here is Harry Road All right, one, two, three, go. There's a bicyclist there. Hopefully we can pass them. We're looking for some place called Seawood. All right, this is it right here. All right, I'm going to turn the phone on and signal when we don't run into this guy. And then we're looking for 731. It's at the end of the street, okay, where the street curves. I mean, these guys have been working in this area for a while, and sometimes I can't get to these houses, so... I had to walk the packages around where they're working. So it kind of sucks, man. There's houses on this block that always get packages too right now. <laughs> yeah, you'll, you'll notice a certain houses, they're always getting packages, all right? Some people, like, they work out a home or something, man. They don't go out. They just have stuff delivered all the time. Okay, I think it's uh, 31. All right, it's this one right here. All right, I'm going to go do this number and back up. All right, UPS does not want you to back up as much as possible, all right, because they say it's dangerous, but I have a I have a backup camera, so I say it's not too dangerous. All right, stop here. Uh, I won't put the hazard on. This is, if you're like in a legit parking spot and, you know, people can see you, I don't put the hazard on. Okay, so now we're looking for 731 Seawood. I remember there's a lot of Seawood packages. Oh, here it is. Oh, there's four of them. All right, this one has four. So the, the there's four tracking numbers here. So we got to make sure we find four of them. All right, also, so there's another way that you can... Um, so this tracking number is 6777, the last four numbers. If you look at the last four numbers and you find one that says 6777, you can double tap it. All right, and it says you scanned it. All right, so that's an alternate way to scan it. All right, guys, but another way is to, yeah, just scan it, like, with the camera. Um, seven, here's another one for 731. Like I said, there was a lot for... It's from the Gap and Old Navy. So a lot of people order clothes online, guys. I don't know why I don't do that. But who am I to, who am I to judge, right? <laughs> okay, now I'm out of seawood packages. All of these are clay wood packages. This is my next block over. So I'm going to start moving this stuff up here. This is Grandwood. That's another street. There's a clay wood. Oh, here's, a, here's the last one, okay? Okay, and I, like I said, I, when I scan it, I put it on top of the vehicle. I'm going to put my MDA away in my pouch. Pick up the packages. All right, they're just all these garbage bag type of thing, man. They're clothing, so you can be rough with it. <laughs> Don't be too rough with it, though. I'm going to crinkle up their clothes. All right, I'm going to hide it right here. All right. I'm going to wake it up. Take a picture. 
stop complete boom all right driver released it's a beautiful thing guys <laughs> Um, there will be some packages you will have to get signatures for, guys, but uh, so far I haven't run into any yet. Which way is this? So, okay, 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 okay. So, so you can look at the map and see where you're going, all right? Um, we're going to go, the numbers are supposed to go up. Yeah, we, numbers are going up now, so we're looking for 758. So on the right is the odds. The way we're looking in our, in our perspective, on the right is the odds, the left is the evens, all right? So 758 is will be on the left, obviously. It's an even, right? So I'm gonna wanna look at the left for it, the address. I know you guys can't see it, you guys are just see the steering wheel, but I'm looking for a 758, that's 750 we just passed. Seven, I think it's this one, but I can't read it. Yeah, okay. So here, here's a weird one, guys. So I can't see that the house number is like, it's kind of messed up, man. They, they need to fix their freaking house number. So here's a way to look for houses, guys. Um, let, me, let me find this package first. Um, so we're looking for a 758, and that was 750. All right, the next house, I don't know what it is. I can't read it, man. But this house is 759. So most of the time, across the street should be 758. Boom, that's it right there, right? The house number, you can't, I can barely read the house number. And there's a number on the curb, all right? So you see this, see this one says 759 on it? So this one doesn't have it. So this one doesn't have it on the curb and the house number is all messed up. So it makes it difficult to find the house, all right? The other way is to use the GPS, all right? And most of the time I will do that. Oh, here it is right here. Okay, that's our last seed package. Generally, I get house, I get packages for that 747 house over there. <laughs> Not today, I guess. <laughs> so I can't, I can barely read it from the street. But when you go up close to it, it says 758. They need to like paint it again or something. See, it's a, it's a, it's a black num, it's a black background. So there's another package here. I'm just gonna put it right next to it. Okay, there's nowhere to hide it. So. You could knock on the door. If you feel like you're in a shady neighborhood where somebody's gonna steal it and there's nowhere to hide it, I usually knock on the door so so they know. All right, but um, yeah, they need to fix that number, man. You can't see it. It should look like that one. See how that one's nice and readable? That one, I can still see the curb number. This one, you can't see the curb number. It's uh, And it's underneath the vehicle, so. <laughs> yeah. So fix your number, guys. Fix your numbers. I want to say have to light up numbers too so at night you can see the numbers all right oh there's another one on seawood never mind i lied there's a seven oh there's 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 more all right but wait there's more all right two houses over is 766 it says on the gps so i can i can read it on the gps so is that 762 766 should be the next one um, okay this is another house where i can't see the number all right the number is like way back there that's why okay get out deliver it hopefully I can find it I let me see let me look at my list there's a list of stuff that we're not supposed to deliver oh yeah oh yeah this is one of them 766 okay we're gonna skip this one 766 and 778 we don't do because they don't we don't have them oh yeah that's the next one also okay we I know we don't have these all right so and they're only one package each okay so it only says this one package to be delivered to that address, and it's on my list, all right? It's on my list of packages we don't have. We're going to skip these, all right, guys? So we're going to head to the Claywood one. All right, Claywood is the next block over. So we'll, I will have to come back here later, guys. <laughs> I will tell you that now. We're coming back later to deliver these packages, but not, not now because we don't have them, okay? All right, we're going to 6987. Claywood. Okay, we need to make a right here onto Harry Road. We make another ride onto Claywood Road. Watch out for the bicyclists, man. There's bicycles. There's a lot of people that bicycle around here. Alright, 6987 is gonna be odds are on the left, so it should be on our left. It should be really close here. Uh that's 68 6991. The next one should be 6987. Okay, there we go. Okay, and then I can see us pull up on the map right there. Okay. Let's start.
Okay, so now we're all looking for clay wood packages. There's a 6983. That one is like the next house. I think. But we're looking for 6987. There's a lot. Oh, here's one. Okay, Amazon Prime package. Scan it. Oh, my ankle is starting to hurt already. So I'm just taking it easy, guys. <laughs> They want, don't work too fast, but don't work too slow, guys. All right? If you're feeling tired, just take a break. You know? check, check your email. So, you know. I'll just leave it on the bench there. There's nowhere to hide it. So. Okay, stop complete. Sometimes it's, it's kind of laggy, man. It's all, it's all wireless, guys. So it uses the interweb. So 6983 is the next one. I think it's this one right here. Let's see. Yep, that's 6983. So I'm, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say we're gonna, um, I'm gonna walk it. So, okay, one package. That was the one I was looking at earlier. It's this one. Okay. Damn, dude. This is so. I'm not gonna lie, guys. It's easy today. All right. I, the, um, the dealer. I was able to sort everything in a way like you know I can find it easily. Most days it's not like that, guys. <laughs> Most days there's just shit everywhere, guys, and it's just I'm in there digging around, so and then digging around in the rain. Oh my god, dude! The, this week has been awful with the rain, man. The layering packages in the rain sucks, but somebody's got to do it, right? Rain or shine. Like uh, like they say in the army, right? If it ain't raining, we ain't training, right? Because no matter what, you're going to go into combat, <laughs> right? No matter what, you got to get the job done, guys. I always admire the I, uh, the houses and stuff. This house has four solar panels on it. He used to make a, put solar panels on his own house, so I, I like to admire other people's work. Or like, you know, the solar panels they have on there. Okay. It's not in school. We're going to 6972. Um, that's an even, so it's going to be on the right, guys. I think it's. So that's why I like to use the eco throttle, the eco mode, because I don't have to step on the throttle. It's this one right here. Um, I'm gonna go in front of this. Oh, there's a freaking pile of leaves. Oh, it's fine. Okay. They're doing some kind of construction here. Okay, we're gonna park behind this pile of leaves here. All right, because like I said, I like to park in f uh, ahead of the house a little bit. All right. All right, we're not looking for an 6972. There's three of them, guys. Three. I got three tracking numbers here. So that's 44. That's not it. This is one of them. Scan this, put on top of the car. There's not that much left, man. Okay, there's a Macy's package right here. These are all Macy's packages. Okay, this one, I'll put it on top of the car. Don't want to scratch my car. <laughs> this is a Marewood, Marewood, Claywood. Okay, I've got a Noonwood here. Oh, so I'm gonna start reorganizing. I'm gonna start moving stuff so I can find it. Why is this? So I can find stuff. Oh, this is the ground where this is going to be coming up. I'll put this. Carrying wood. I can't find this one. I can't find it. Oh, wait. There's another one hiding back here. Oh, nope. It's not it either. These are ground woods. Oh, here it is. Yep, most of the time, if you can't find it, it's hiding under something. Okay, okay, that's all of them. It beeped, so it said, oh, you got them all. You found them. You're a rock star, Merlin. <laughs> all right. And then this is the house we're delivering to. So this house has no numbers on it except the mailbox, all right? And I know when we pass the mailbox, we're at the right place. But like I said, it's always good to double check, you know? But like I said, I've been doing this so long. I <laughs> do this route so long that, like, I kind of know where to look already. 
I'm gonna put it behind the pot. Let's put it this door. Okay. That way, keeps it away from uh, prying eyes. So, like, if I look here from the street, oh, I can kind of see it still, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This white stuff is easy to see. There we go. <laughs> Yes, Hayes Bay genuinely cares about your packages, guys. <laughs> but it's common sense, guys. If you don't have any place to hide it, then I can't do anything for you guys, <laughs> okay? Okay, so 69.44, it says is that way, okay? According to the map. It's basically, we're looking right at it. It's at the end of the block. Whoa, it's kind of hot. Now I'll take a look on our quick, uh, we'll take a water break or something in a bit. Do the turn signal. There's a there's a pile of leaves in front of us. One day I just rode over, drove over the leaves. <laughs> there's a pg and &E truck here. You're gonna see all sorts of stuff throughout the day, man. Mailman, FedEx. There's a oh, that, speak it speak at the devil. There's the mail lady right there. <laughs> There's a, there's a carrier. Mail carrier. I used to do that, guys. It's an awful job. Um, if you like walking a lot, that's the job for you. Alright, 6944. Right here. Scan it. Oh, walk up the driveway. I know these houses are pretty nice and clean, so most of them are. I'm going to go put it um, behind Santa here. Put it in front of Santa. Who would? Uh, oh, what kind of thief? What kind of porch pirate would steal a package in front of Santa Claus, guys? <laughs> oh, I hit stop complete. Boom, we're done. Okay. Now we're going to some place called Mayor Wood. Do I have a grand one package? Let me see. Oh yeah, I do. I have two for here. Okay, so here I'm going to do something. I I know this house. All right. That's this house right here, 6952. In fact, I'm not even, I'm just gonna walk there from here. <laughs> We're literally right across from it. Um, there's a 6952 Grandwood, and I know this house. They get packages all the time. I don't see it. <clears throat> Okay, so yeah, we're, we're kind of at that point where we're gonna, we need to start orga reorganizing everything. All right, so this is 6977. I'm looking for a 6953 Grandwood. Okay, so we're at, we're at that point where we need to start moving everything. Um, I'm gonna put this. Oh, oh, Bearwood is coming up next too. So uh, I don't want to move everything too much. All right, I'm gonna put all these. See all these Grandwood packages? We're gonna move them up here. Right, Grandwood, 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 Grandwood. This one's a Noonwood, Honeywood, Noonwood, Honeywood. Oh, here's one. Okay, found one. So yeah, you gotta organize as you go. Oh, oh, hold on. Sometimes you can just, you can hit the, there's a scan button here. You just scan it and it will go to the one that you want. All right, so it says there's one more package I gotta look for, so. It, it might be in the back, guys. Yes, it is. It's in the back. What'd I say? <laughs> so typically, if you can't find it in the front, it's gonna be in the back, guys. And we're at the point where we're, we're about halfway through this, this uh, section. This is heavy. <sighs> and I, his mega said he wanted to carry it. Great. It's okay, so we're not too far. Okay, I'm gonna put my phone, the MDA, in the pouch. I'm gonna grab the package, close this, and I'm gonna grab the other package on the top here that I scanned earlier. I'm gonna go walk to 6952, which is right here. How do I know? Because I've done this route like a gazillion times. <laughs> well, not a gazillion, but enough that I know. Oh, look at it. There's a walkway right here. 
surprise. <laughs> yeah, there's a walkway. All right, well, I gotta walk on the grass a little bit. So see, the, 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 the mail, the post office already delivered something here. They're gonna hide it back behind the pillar, wake the phone up, take a picture of the package, and head on back. Interesting thing at this walkway here. Oh, there's like a, there's like some kind of, like a storage area right here. This is like a weird house, man. This pack, this house gets a lot of packages. I don't know why. I've, I've delivered, um, oh, oh we're, okay, we're, now we're going to go back to our route. Uh, we're going to go back to the Marywood, okay. Marywood is two blocks over, okay, according to the, the map. Okay. Built on. Oh, I'm getting sweaty. I don't take a break. Maybe the next block. Okay. So you notice I haven't had to turn the vehicle on or off the whole time. If I, I'm not gonna lie, if I'm in a sketchy place where I think somebody's gonna, you know, rob my vehicle or take off with it, I will turn it off, all right, and lock it. But I feel, I feel pretty safe in this neighborhood, so I don't, I just leave the vehicle on, all right, guys. It's up to you if you want to leave your vehicle on or off, but I always leave it on, all right? Most of the time. If, if I'm going to be away from it for a while, I turn it off. Okay, so two blocks over. Make a right. We're looking for 734. Marewood. It's going to be on the right. According to the GPS, is this next one right here. Okay, see, there you go. The GPS works, dude. I'm telling you, sometimes like when you can't find the house, like if it's behind another building or something, you'll you can find it. Like the the GPS knows. Like they, it's pretty it's pretty good uh, GPS system that UPS made up. All right, I'm sure it uses Google Maps and stuff, but all right, I'm looking for a Marewood package. I believe they're here on the side. All right, that's a 728 Mare. Here it is, 734. It's a big one, so I'm gonna open the back. Big stuff. I take out the bag. Okay, this one's. This one is going to be. Let's put. Let's put this one. Let's put this down. Oh, Noonwood. This is going to be a coming up too. I'm going to put this up there. Okay, see, like I'm constantly organizing, guys. Okay. I can hold it with one hand, so I'm going to hold my phone. Walk up. I'm gonna hit, it says, res, it's asking me if it's a residential or commercial. Um, as an SSD, guys, I don't do commercial deliveries, all right? Um, that's when you have to go to a business and have a sign for it and you give it to somebody. But sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. But for the most part, they don't. Okay, no place to hide that one, so I'll deliver it there. Okay. Okay, now next one is 728 Marywood. That's the other one that we saw. So if you see other packages that you see you're gonna deliver later, set them aside <laughs> okay set them aside set, set them someplace you can find them easily all right so sometimes they're kind of mixed up a little bit and you're gonna have to sift through them all right i'm gonna put my seatbelt on guys because we're just going around this truck oh we could have literally just walked to this one man all right so we're since we're parking in the middle of the street i'm gonna put my hazard on i believe it's this one on the right here uh, let's see. yeah it says we're here already so okay and it was that package, this one right here. Okay. But look at that. Almost all the packages are gone. Half the packages are gone already, guys. And we're going to have to go do it again <laughs> when we're done with these. Okay, right, so it says 728 there. put this one right here okay there's nowhere to really hide it 728 I look at the sign there it says 728 yeah, that one some of them even have the a street name that one says Marywood on it so okay we're going to someplace called Finchwood next okay so we're gonna skip we're gonna skip two blocks and there's a lot of deliveries on Grandwood that we're gonna be skipping or that we're not doing so uh, typically for this route 
we'll go to the end. It's like the almond wood. Remember, we, we drive all the way to the end and we delivered it and then we turned around. That's what we do here. But um, we don't have that many deliveries for this area today. So we're going to skip a lot of it, man. Some days you're going to deliver all the streets. Some days you're going to skip a lot of them. So just fell down, man. Okay. Yeah, dude, we had like a flat screen TV. <laughs> That's one of the ones that we didn't have. That one you probably might want to knock on the door. All right, we're going to make a left here. And then Finchwood. Finchwood is up there. We're going to make a right. All right, here's Finchwood. Make a right turn. This is this is about a house that we delivered earlier, remember. All right, I can see us on the GPS. The GPS says it's three houses down. One, two, okay, where this, see where this green, green Toyota Highlander is? That's the house. No, it's not. It's because it's on the other side. Ace Mega was looking at the right. <laughs> All right, it's supposed to be on the other side. So it's 766, it's not 765. Okay. I'm gonna go find our Finchwood. I don't remember seeing any Finchwood packages, man. This is noon. This is grand. Another grand wood. Yeah, I don't. I don't remember seeing any fish wood, man. Let me see. I got honey woods. Yeah, see now. Now I don't know where it is. We've got noon woods. Those are coming up. I don't see a finch wood, man. Moving some of this stuff up. Oh, oh, there's more stuff down here. Noon wood. Honeywood. Oh, I'm gonna start moving stuff up. Ice wood. Oh, you crikey. Okay. Oh, here it is. <laughs> I was just looking. I was looking at boxes and stuff. This is it right here. Oh, that's 790. Okay, that's not it, but we're gonna do that one later. So I'm gonna set that one aside here. All right. It might be in the back, dude. Go look in the back. These are noon woods. That's a carry wood. This is gonna be in a little bit. Can't find it, guys. It might be underneath this box here. Nope. Serenity Way. I don't... What the heck? I don't have it. Oh, there's one right here. <laughs> I hit one right here. Okay, that's not it either. What about, what's this one? Oh, what do you know? The last one I check is the one. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. Yeah. So at some point, we're gonna move those packages in the back, move them to the front. Okay, if they're not too big, move them to the front. Okay, um, I can't really hide this too well, but I'm gonna put it behind the plant here. Okay, stop complete. Uh, what the heck, man? No, I saw another Finchwood package, man. Right here, 790. See, okay, okay, watch this, watch this, watch this, guys. So I saw that we have another Finchwood package and literally the rest of Finchwood is right here, guys. Um, what I'm gonna do is hit the map here and it'll show you a map of where all the deliveries are, okay? It's pretty, pretty rad, right? We're gonna zoom in, all right? We're gonna zoom in, hope you guys can see. All right, so right here, that's that package, the 790. I'm gonna click on it, 790, all right? And then you hit there. All right, and then it shows you the map. It's it's literally one, two, it's almost three houses up. All right, so all I gotta do, we're gonna drive three houses up and then we're gonna do a U-turn and do the route the regular way. All right, so now we're, we're going off route, okay? So we're doing. So I'm looking for 790. It should be on the left here. I think it's this one with the blue Tesla in front of it. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. 
I'm gonna park across from it. Park, grab the phone, get start. Okay, and I'm gonna look for that 790 package. All right, it's a Disney package, by the way, guys. Yeah, sometimes I get some interest. I get interesting packages. I had like I was delivering bidets one day and some weird stuff, you know, comforters and. Okay, 790 right here. Know where to hide it. Just put it in front of the door. Take a picture. It'll last longer. <laughs> Stop complete. Done. All right, now I'm going to go back to the list. I'm going to go back up and then continue on our way. We're going to go to 6971 Grandwood. So we're going to turn around and go back on that Grandwood Street that we were on earlier. Okay. So. So I saved myself having to go down this block later, because later we're gonna go down this block, Royal Wood, all right, in front, that's in front of us. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna go turn around and then we're gonna go all the way to the, according to the map, we're gonna go turn around and go all the way to the end of the block. And it's the sec, and we're gonna make a right and it's the second house on the right. Okay. Man, having a hybrid vehicle, do, using a hybrid for a delivery vehicle is the best thing here. I don't know why the post office didn't have like hybrid delivery vehicles, you know. They're still using those old clunkety LLVs, man. I know UPS does have some hybrid, uh, they do have some hybrid uh, package cars, man. But uh, they're not very good from, <laughs> from what I heard. They're not very good. I actually did delivery. I did a delivery in one before. I didn't get to... Oh, he's right here, by the way. Uh, I didn't get to drive the hybrid delivery truck. The, the But uh, I, I got to be a driver helper in one of them. I, I was the one that sat in the jump seat and they, here, here's the package, go deliver it. <laughs> the driver gives it to you, right? I got to do that and it, it was kind of weird. Like, it, yeah, it was kind of noisy. And I mean, it was in a Toyota hybrid, man. So it was... All right, 6977, that's literally the house that we parked right in front of, all right? Um, but that's not the house we're delivering. It's 6971 is the first one. So we're looking, looking, looking. I can't find it. Maybe it's this one right here. No. It's this butterfly one. Yep, that's the one. Okay. So. Okay. I know, now I know that the next delivery is this house right here, okay? So. How did I know? Well, I just looked at it and uh, I didn't even look at it on the board, man. I looked at it. I looked at, man, there's something in here and it's like, it's heavy and it kind of moves around a lot. Okay, dogs are barking. Hopefully they'll keep the Porsche Pirates away. Okay, delivered. Okay, it's so next one, 6977. There's two packages and I already found them, like I mentioned. We're gonna go back. If I was really slick, I would have taken all, all with me, man. <laughs> It's okay, man. We get paid by the hour. <laughs> Just gotta tell yourself that. We get paid by the hour, guys. Okay. Okay. Boom. Okay. These gardeners, man. I, I hate gardeners, dude. Sorry, if you're a gardener, dude, I, you guys are blowing crap all over the place all the time, making noise. Um, I'm gonna hide this over here. See, there's a little uh, uh, a gator. There's a gator over there. <laughs> I know there's a gator there. Okay. Okay. Now we're gonna go to 6983. That's the next house over. Um, it's up to, you know what? I'm gonna walk over there. It's up to you if I want to do it, but there's a lot of, there's no parking over there. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, there's three of them though, man. They're a good thing they're small. Okay, so they're these small ones. This is Amazon. Uh, there's another one right here. I'm missing one. Where you at, buddy? Right here. It's this, it's that one that I grabbed that was hiding on the other side. It's right here. Oh my god, the, the wrapping is coming off of this. Okay. I'm going to holster my phone. Grab those two packages. Make sure they're the right ones now. Okay. Yep. I didn't put it on top of the vehicle. Okay, so we're gonna go deliver these. I've got them. Um, I'm holding them like a football. <laughs> I 
want to stay away from these gardener guys, man. Yeah, sometimes you'll see people doing construction on the house, cleaning the pool, all sorts, just all sorts of people. There's people installing solar panels on the house. Yeah, man, there's all sorts of people out doing stuff out here. Okay, so I'm gonna hide it behind Mr. Claus here. Okay, take a picture. I have to wake the phone up because it fell asleep. It's not complete. Okay, now we're gonna go to some place called Carrywood. I don't think I have this package. Okay, the next block over is Carrywood. I'm getting tired. I'm getting sweaty. It's kind of. I kind of want to take a break. Uh, so how far are we? It's about 12 o'clock, guys. We started at 11, so we've been. I've been doing this about an hour, and we've done how many deliveries already? We just did 29 deliveries. So, okay, so in one hour, 29 in an hour, guys. So imagine if we did 30. If we did 30. Yeah, let's say we did 30 an hour, right? Times it by six. That's 180 stops, dude. If we were just to just keep on banging out deliveries like this. But like you saw, a lot of the stops are really, really easy. You know, I think I'm going to take a break. But this carry wood, we don't have it. We don't have this one. So we're going to skip it. But we have this other carry wood. Uh, let's do this. Let's do this one first. I'll wait. I'll wait till I get a good spot to take a break, man. I'm kind of tired. But we're looking for triple seven. It'll be on the right. And I think it's this house with the palm tree up here. Is it? Yep. Triple seven. Okay. Oh, we can take a break right here. Let's let's do that. Okay, hit start. We're looking for a carry wood, triple seven. All right, I've got a noon wood here. Oh, noon wood is right here, guys. That's noon wood right there. So we're going there next. So uh, since I know we're going there next, I'm gonna put all these noon wood packages. Oh, oh honey wood, man. Oh, noon wood. This is noon wood. I'm gonna put this in the front because we're going there next. Honey wood. Noon wood. Oh, this is another new wood right here. There's a lot of new wood packages. Oh, damn. I bet it's all going to one house. So I'm looking for a carry wood. All right, and I feel like it's in the back. Let's go look in the back. Remember, we skipped one because we didn't have it, but we should have this one. All right, unless we unless the driver forgot to give it. There it is. Triple seven carry wood. There you go. See. And also, yeah, you know, when you pack, when you're packing the car up in the day, guys, those Tetris skills that you used when you were a kid, you know, playing Tetris is going to come in handy now. <laughs> Trying to get, you know, pieces and packages in the, the right spot in every little nook and cranny of your vehicle. I'm going to put it in front of the snowman here. There you go, guy. Okay. Stop complete. Okay, we're gonna take a break. So I'm gonna go do the whole, uh, we're gonna do the whole uh, thingy. Um, we'll finish the all 7,000s and then that'll be the end of the video, guys. And then I'll do a vlog at the end of the day, okay? And uh, I'll let you know what happens the rest of the time, but I'm only gonna do one one load, all right? One hen, hen number, all right, one 7,000. <laughs> So I do the 7,000s and the 8,000s normally, all right? Some trucks, they'll give you 5,000. It depends how big the truck is, too. Some trucks don't have an 8,000 ledge, you know, shelf. All right, and we're going to take a break here. Okay, take a 10-minute break. Um, so, yeah, if you get if you guys are getting tired, you're getting hungry, take a break, all right? Um, you're out here. You're kind of managing your own time, all right? Um, so the only thing is... All right, so the only thing is for lunches, guys. For lunches, uh, if you go over six hours, six hours, you need to take a lunch, all right? So you gotta keep track of your time, all right? We start kind of late in the day, so actually the lunch is actually my dinner, okay, guys? 
So, but uh, but right now I could probably eat my sandwich. I did bring a sandwich with me. Um, generally, I eat the sandwich after I'm done with my first load, and I and I pick up the new load. I go somewhere and I I'll, I'll show you guys when we get there. Okay, guys. But anyway, I'm gonna go take a break. I'm gonna take like a 10 minute break and then I'll see you guys in 10 minutes. I, I, we're, we're moving really fast, guys, too too fast. <laughs> if you ask me, all right? I, I did it for the video, I did it for the content, guys. I wanted to show you what it was like to deliver packages as SSD, all right? And we're gonna do one load and then uh, and then yeah, and then I'll, get, I'll do a couple of vlogs here and there throughout the day and that'll be it. All right, see you guys in a bit.